started buying and selling silver and gold bullion, I was buying it for obviously less than I was selling it for. By the time I was 13, I had made over £10,000 in profit. Now, that didn't last forever. So I started to look for other areas that I could make money in. I saw a trending video on Facebook of, uh, called Never Wet, and I noticed that it was only for sale in America. Started with my first shipment of five, then worked my way up to 10, and a couple months down the line, I was selling over 100 a week. I then looked for other things to do. I had the opportunity of buying a classic car. It was a 1986 300 SL. I bought that, restored it a bit, and then flip that a few months later. My latest venture is property development. I'm always thinking about business and what I do and what I can be doing and how I can move forward and new ideas are racing around my head. If, if there's a question to be answered, I'll find the answer to that question. If there's a challenge to be overcome, the only thing I'll say to myself is, okay, what do I need to do to overcome that challenge? There's no, there's no mindset of what happens if I fail and if you do fail, it's, I'll still get back up, even if I go bankrupt. Age is just a number, it doesn't affect me at all. If anything, it motivates me more because I'm young. Yeah, you can't let it put you off. Do whatever you do to reach that goal. If you want to do something, or if you want to achieve something, there is no reason why you can't, you just have to put your mind to it.